people have told me, you know, I need to try therapy. I, I, really, I really don't like hearing that. It's kind of like, I don't go up to people who are really fat and say, hey, have you tried insulin? You know, have you guys tried Weight Watchers? So if, if you say, hey, try therapy, it means one of two things. Either I'm not going to therapy and I should, or I've been going to therapy and it's not fucking working. <laughs> Neither one's bad. So, but I figured, you know, why would I pay somebody, you know, $100 an hour for 200 sessions? Better to just go in front of 200 people once and, you know, it works out mathematically, right? So, the, the reason that I sort of have a, have a bit of a problem is I, uh, I've had sort of an identity at any crisis. Um, I sort of pretended to be like a normal, kind of cool, average guy. But uh, I figured Hollywood's probably the place to come out of the closet. Okay, so, so in reality, I'm not, I'm not a cool guy at all. I'm actually a, a, a huge nerd. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 I literally mean huge. I mean, I, I go to the San Diego Comic Con, and it's like me, the guy who dresses Chewbacca, and the guy who dresses Darth Vader are the only people over six foot tall. I'm just kind of like walking around like we're Gandalf surrounded by hobbits. Oh, uh, I almost stopped at you. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Do you have any Batman action figures? But, uh, yeah, that's actually my favorite superhero by far, is of course Batman. I like it because it's the only member of the Justice League. You can watch the movie and be like, you know, I think I could do that. <laughs> you know, it, it kind of still Batman to, to his essence, right? He's got the, the two things that make him Batman. There's the big inheritance, and then there's the trauma of his parents' horrible death. So what I've been doing is trying to talk my parents to buy a lot of Apple stock, and then buy them tickets to like midnight showings to theaters in like Pomona. You know, like, no, 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 no. You want to take the shortcut through the long dark alley. That's the long dark alley. And, and just, just linger, you know, take your time and stroll. You know, I figured I should attach a, rock, attach a rocket booster to my black car and then I'll be there, right? But, uh, yeah, you, you go with the, the other ones, you know, you're like, I can't even get a tan, much less super strength and flight from the, the yellow sun, so no Superman. I think you're really lucky with the jewelry store the swap meet to be Green Lantern, that probably have. And, uh, and the penis pretty much means Wonder Woman, not gonna happen. So, so that is pretty much it. You know, and, and I figure, you know, that it's not really that unrealistic. I, I watched The Dark Knight and, you know, I think some other guys sort of do this too. You watch and you think, not just, you know, I could do that, but you think, you know those times Batman fucked up? You know, his girlfriend died, Joker won a little bit. I was Batman. I don't think I fucked up like that. <laughs> <laughs> I've done a better job. I'm trying to do talk. Drew would have fucking talked if I was Batman. <laughs> and I would have laid the pressure down. And I'm, I've been working on the, on the voice, too, you know? Because that, I think the key point is the uh, the voice. Because he was just Bruce Wayne, right? He developed the voice. He told me he's Batman. You be dead. <laughs> Can we trust him? You know, I, I don't know exactly what, why that works, but somehow, somehow it does. You know, permission. Uh, so then the uh, the one problem though with Batman is uh, for some reason he can't hold down a girlfriend, which always baffles me. Right? You know, Superman, he's an alien from another planet. He always has a study girl, right? He has Lois Lane, it always works out. You have like Spider-Man, who has the most disgusting superpower ever. He's like, I've got little things going on my hands where I can crawl walls. I shoot spider webs. Have you ever met a girl who likes spiders? <laughs> and yet somehow, Spider-Man can be a girl and, and Batman can't. So I'm kind of hoping that maybe, you know, maybe if I try hard enough and, and get become Batman enough, I, I can overcome that, of course. Just like Batman fucks up, you know, maybe I won't at the same time. And then I can sort of attract another, maybe a, maybe a nerdy girl, you know, somebody who I can uh, go and explore the world uh, of Warcraft with. <laughs> anyway, thanks for being great. And, uh, <laughs> Started the show off with a virgin. <laughs> I'm just saying, because he reads comic books, he's got to be a virgin.